Hi, I'm Kelly Busby from Kingwood College, and we're going to talk about moving the age cylinder. This is the cap, and at all times I either keep my hand on the shoulder of the tank or on the cap of the tank. We keep the seat belt on at all times. It's not really a seat belt, but we call it a seat belt. This is the cart. You should use a four-wheel cart, which we have a four-wheel, three-wheel carts aren't safe. So we're moving this forward at all times holding it. And then when I turn around here, I'm going to take the tank off the cart. Now I'm putting my body here to keep the tank from falling over and I'm starting to pull back. Now when I pull back, the cart's going to fall back. It's okay. Notice how I'm keeping the tank close to my body. If I start to pull away, I just move closer. Now I'm going to go back the other direction. It might be easier for some people to actually move around the other direction. It doesn't matter as long as you get it safely back on the cart without spilling it over. If this was to fall and you were to knock off the, uh, the valve stand, it would shoot around the room like a party balloon, except this party balloon would actually break arms and legs. Now what I'm going to do is lift this up and I'm going to scoop it under just like you scooped um, trash under a, um, a dust pan. Now I'm using my belly again, and I lock it in place, now I can walk away. There.